Well, is not something. We are still very cautious, very slow. Uh, and I'm a little bit scared that I'm running out of time with the whole conversion thing. Uh, Unite Africa, we are definitely not in control of the complete region of Africa. As you can see, there are still bits and bobs that don't belong to it. Actually, ah, this is unpassable terrain. So we only really need to take this from them. And I think we can go to war. Uh, let's check their current strength. Oh, that's that's good. We can we can finally phase them out. So these claims are all stuff nobody cares about, and this is the last thing that we have. So uh, the Eastern Desert is our last destination. They have eleven thousand troops at their disposal. We have far more, far greater armies. Um, obviously, well, I, I say obviously, but isn't so obvious by the way i'm gonna try this from now on because i actually kind of would enjoy if this channel grew a little bit so like and subscribe <laughs> oh my god uh and if you already subscribed do like I, I think liking does things not just to me but also to the video uh and the channel i mean i see people do it and I, it, it seems to work so why not give it a good old college try I, I swear, I solemnly swear, I will not overdo it. But I'll throw it out there. Because, well, okay, let's go a little bit basic. This channel has a very specific reason for existing. Oh, oh, what's coming? Merely 5,000. Should we get ourselves at least a free holy order? I think we should get ourselves at least a free holy order, and after that I will... I promise to finish my thought. Let's get them. They're free and they're cool, because they're armored horses, and lots of them. Alright, so... Um, why do I say it is... Potentially sensible to increase the viewership here? The, the channel has a very specific reason for existing, as I said. It is a bridge. A bridge between me and some loved ones of mine that I cannot be physically with. Not just due to pandemic reasons, but just due to distance reasons. That are still currently ongoing. Which hopefully one day won't be ongoing as such, but then maybe uh, the, the channel will still exist, but in a different way and for different reasons. Now... Why do I think this is still good to expand it beyond the people that are already here? By the way, thanks for being here. I am very happy you are. Um, I really enjoyed to see people actually watching this. And I know it's not just the people I make this for. <laughs> there are at least two or three more that actually watch this and are not part of that illustrious circle. Ooh, do I want to pay 107 gold for this? Yeah, kinda, but not to go there. Where is your capital these days? Oh, up there. That's too far away. Okay, uh, we're not gonna land right there. We're gonna land next to them. So, as I said, I... Uh, didn't I want to click on that? Yes, I wanted. Oh, well. I know that there are people watching this that are not part of that initial reason for creating this channel. And I'm very grateful for everyone who is here, and I wonder what your motivations are. To some of you, I've talked uh, through comments here and there, and I appreciate those. I do try and reply here and there. Not necessarily to absolutely every comment I get, uh, but to some. Because, well, I, I'm also not the greatest social butterfly you'll ever encounter, so uh, do forgive me. Speaking of do forgive me... Might just push a fight here. The prime to win this. Will we catch him? Yes. 
Or we beat him down far enough before the reinforcements arrive to make it... Yes, that that's gonna stick. Sorry, I get distracted by war. As you would. So I think uh, it is important... That this scrolls a little bit because it shows me that it's not in vain. Uh, I'm... And I don't think I'm alone with that because it's a very human experience. The, the, the struggle for sense and purpose, you know? When I talk to some of you people, as I just said, it, it feels like there is a reason for being here, just generally in life, you know? Of course, we all have jobs or family or friends and uh, partners or kids even. Uh, pets. Not forgetting pets. Uh, and they all have their own place and reason and they're gonna do certain things to us and make us happy or sad, depending. Ideally, they make us happy, of course. But they also give a sense of purpose. If you do something nice for someone and they enjoy it, and that's just enjoyable in return. Unless you are a socio and something or other path then uh, potentially you might see it a little bit different but that's up to you i mean you you needn't see things my way in in this regard uh, that's perfectly fine by me look there's petra um so having more people here gives me simply more motivation to do even more stuff because the people i do this for they just kind of tell me, ooh, I'm through this and that. And then I know, I okay, I, I pick up recording new stuff again. And uh, provide new content for them to follow and watch. With strangers that I have maybe potentially only talked to through comments or the odd chat. Uh, I don't know that. I, I don't know when, when you're done or what you're even interested in. So it's hard to adjust. Therefore, I've decided very early on, no matter where this goes in, in terms of subscribers or viewers or whatever, I'll just do my thing and enjoy it as best I can. And as you have seen, those of you who have been around for a while, there are fairly long breaks here and there because sometimes I just don't really feel like doing content, uh, creating stuff, recording stuff, just, just don't feel like it, so I don't do it. Because I'd rather not give anything than something subpar. I don't really have much of a expectation for myself in terms of quality of content. Ooh, he's being chased around. So, you know, if some things are good, then some things are good. If some things aren't all that good, then, well, then they're not really all that good. That's all fine in its own way. But I know if I do it for more than just a handful of people, uh, it's yeah, it's just gonna be a little bit nicer for me, for myself. You no, know? that's really all there is to it. I'll try to avoid a little rebellion at home. I mean, they're still far out. We might be done until then. Just this one siege and then we're finished. Since our enemy is being chased around by a huge blob of something else. Let's just hope the huge blob of something else doesn't roll over us. Which it very well might. If it spots us and thinks, no, I don't want you to do the thing you're doing there. And we might have to abandon our siege. Let's slow this down considerably. So, ah... Uh, so we know exactly where he's gonna go. I'm just kind of expecting him to follow there. Yeah, okay, that's that's okay. He's not coming our way. As we're fighting these bigger nations, way more considerations come into play, and I like that. That's really pretty cool. All right, and we're done. We have finished up down here in the south. Is ours and now there's only uh, lots of wars against the Byzantine Empire left and they are currently at full strength it looks 
like while we are not equally strong uh he's a fortune builder so he's probably in this yeah that gives a whole lot of troops this tree here does it one of these troops uh, yeah we're not gonna fight him he's he's gonna out earn us and out fight us unless there is a very clear opening we're not we're not going in Not spreading dangerously so i mean of course if they attack us then we will have to fight them back there's no two ways about that but Let's see, what can we do here? Is that one duchy? No, that's two. We could go for a holy war on a kingdom. We haven't done that in a while, but it's uh, it's kind of small fry. Then again, we don't need much else, really. Take it. How old are we? 50. Ah, I don't think there's going to be another kingdom we want to invade a holy war against. So we'll just take it. Ah, would we take all that? I hope not. I, I don't want these bits. I just want this. 7,700. Should we wait this? 19 months. This is all domestic terrorism. <laughs> So they're here anyway. Might as well engage in a war there. Oh goodness. It's the same person again. It's always the same person. Uh, an alliance. No. No. Are you are you joking? Alright. So we're doing this. Seven thousand it said they had. So what do we need? About the same, maybe a little less. Can speed it up again. That's fine. Oh an ally joined! Yeah, doesn't matter. We're just swarming in. Gonna have the woman. No need for her. He already knows what's coming, so he joins while there's still someone to join. But it seems like they're engaged in some war anyway. We always start with the headquarters if they're well the, the capital if it if it is within reach and most certainly it is here. <clears throat> All right, while we do that, let's build another temple or two. We'll check <clears throat> all the hotbeds of uh, wrong think. <laughs> oh my god, that's terrible. Oh, I wanted to check these anyway. This is a shrine, right? But it's occupied by uh, Magdia. Temple holding. It doesn't tell us anything. Does it also spread like... Does it do something special? Does it help? Church holdings. It gives piety. I don't know if these actually help to convert people. I kind of don't think they do. Ten years, that's so long. I think our best bet is really the unification of Africa. I 
think this is the best shot we have at it. But for that, we need a weak Byzantine Empire. How do we weaken a Byzantine Empire? We kill the king! Are there agents that we might involve? by acceptance? Why can't I go by both? Acceptance and success chance. Okay. How much? 75. Two hundred and six now. That's way too much. You should be cheap. Only two. Come on, you blind man. 56. Done. 58. Also done. So the secrecy is increased to 95%. So it's unlikely to be discovered. Now we can go for forced vassalage and just do that with the Byzantines. Just go forced vassalage on them. Uh, I took my eyes of the ball here. 300. Well, that evens the odds. We'll give it. We'll have that. How far away? Nine months. Oh, okay, that's just, eh, that's not not exactly ideal right now. So we'll have to contend with this. Let's raise a few more people here. As a backup. And that's quite enough. Bring those in here. Will you be running forever now? The fool. Just looking for a good spot to fight me, yeah? I can't blame you. Certainly try and do the same. Alright, very good. That was extremely fortuitous and we're not going to stand on our troops. Indeed, we will bring them over here. Or rather over here. Again, no big consideration given to where exactly things are going to happen. There's more popping up. So we're going to sit exactly on top of that by the time he pops up and thinks he can dictate terms. Is he uh, insane? I wonder. It appears to the Royal Majesty that they might be insane. Which kind of sounds like we are insane as well when I say it this way. <laughs> That's just how I speak when I'm very royal and uh, annoyed. By the way, if you have never seen uh, the musical Hamilton, it is uh, worth a watch. At the very least for King George. And if you don't want to watch the whole thing, just watch King George's performance snippets on the YouTubes. Because it's pretty cool. And that's how I imagine every ruler in the world being. Uh, no. Don't think so. I hear you have an ultimatum to make. Well, what is it? Speak. You want freedom? You shall have death. 
We will start with executing these fools here. Well, they're actually pretty decent. Let us make sure we get ahead of these. Don't want them to blob up. This right now doesn't concern me, like they don't scare me, that's just rabble. And rabble, we will trample into the dust. Um... Stress seems to have become a bit more of an issue. Alright, that's one bigger uh, blob taken off the map. It's an equal fight. Do we want an equal fight? Either we take this equal fight. Oh, we just wait here. Maybe they they jump us. We'll just raise some more troops there. Oh, yes. Yes, I support your decision. No, no, I support your decision. All right. If you don't want to come visit me, then I will come visit you. Still want to earn money. more troops coming from the south. We'll have to head them off. Move this over here. Raise ourselves more troops because right now we are getting a little bit problematic. However, if I see this correctly, These are also heathens. Um, yeah, definitely want to head them off. But we might be caught out trying that. We have to bring in these. Let me select them. Thanks. No, why? Why the heck? Why do you think that is the ideal way to get there? I swear. Okay, this will be a terrible situation for us. They are not joining in. And I don't think they'll get caught here. But they are following us now. Oh, we did it! Got the... Th the leader. I almost said bad things. <laughs> okay, we can revoke his title. And of course he will accept. Thanks. Just so. Who else participated in this tomfoolery? You? Anyone else?
Why does no one have children yet? Because they're all just betrothed. Also don't have children anymore. So... Let's see who we have. Sure. Round to someone else in the family? Oh, cousin. Now you have a claim on our stuff. I don't want you to have a claim on our stuff. This person. And you also get this whole thing. Ain't that a treat? And... Give this away as well. Some good bullry. You there. You can have both these. Yes. Alright, so we barely made it out of this one. Actually quite scary. For a moment there. But we got lucky. We did get lucky. Do you belong to generally speaking Galicia can I have this guy come on convert I just gave you like a vassal must be worth something to you sure you can have a hook I don't care Away. Okay, we've almost taken everything here. Isn't teens are all that's left? In a succession war, which almost follows inevitably. In prison boy, it's probably a good reason you are in there to begin with. Fine, nope. There, have more. Do you belong to what? Duchy of Cantabria. Done. Okay. Go. And I will give you this vessel as well. Now we have a strong duke sitting around there. Alright, so we killed the Bazelios. Weakening them quite a bit. He seems very happy about it. And he's very, very low here. So far, so it might be a good opportunity to wrench something from them. I'm annoyed with this. This was avoidable. Do we have all these weird claims in Europe? I think we just want to take this. This is the biggest piece we can take in one go. Uh, and this is what we're gonna do next time. Thank you very much for watching. I don't know why he likes us so much. But that's all right. See you around next time. Until then, bye-bye.